welcome back to the channel everybody as i've been telling everybody i had a drone coming in and in today's video we're going to unbox all the um we're going to unbox all this stuff that came in i cut this bag open all right i got a pad here that uh tells me what um should be here um and then we'll go through let's just get some of these boxes out quick we'll get this bag out of our way and uh, we'll unbox all this stuff. The bag is full of boxes. Let's just set them all down here. All right. All right, there's that bag. Let's get this box out of our way for now. We'll open that up after. If you're new to the channel, hit that thumbs up button, uh, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment. And uh, in this video, we're going to discuss uh, the, a drone. Um, I was contacted by a company and um, we're going to do a review on a drone. And uh, this is the Swellpult Pro 3 drone. They have different platforms. This platform is uh, for filming. And it's the premium, um, so it's a Swell Pro 3 Plus for filming premium. And what the, that um, consists of, it comes with one aircraft, one remote, three drone batteries, one controller battery, uh, a balance charger, balance charger cables, propellers, battery charging cables, ground station, landing gear, accessory package, carry case, and a four case gimbal camera that's all in one thing the extras that were added is a sunshade for the remote a trolling and safety tension release switch the fishing camera with the payload release button an extra remote battery and the v the fvp goggles so let's open some of this stuff up see what we got wow Here's some uh, propellers. Let me tell you, these things gotta be 10 to 12 inches. It says counterclockwise on this one and clockwise on this one. It's got a lock, padlock lock and a padlock open. So I'm assuming when you put those on, and those are, those are big props. All right. So I'm assuming that's what's in that other box too. There's uh, two more props. Those aren't um, like rubber either. Those are uh, some sort of uh, plastic. I don't know how these go back in there. We'll just leave it like that for now. So that's in that box. I'm assuming this is, yeah, that's another set of uh, props because uh, it said propellers times four. So I don't know if it's four separate propellers or if it's sets, four sets, because there's two there and two there. So that's four propellers. Do they mean four sets? Is there more in the other box? Let's see. All right, let's see what this is. All right, in this box we have, oh wow. That's a waterproof three times gimbal 4K camera. And this mounts on the bottom of the drone. This camera pivots up, down, rotates all over the place. And uh, it's for, it's strictly for filming. This one is for, and it is waterproof. Comes with the instructions. Some extra rubber pieces for here and the plastic pieces here. Comes with a whole extra set of that. That's pretty cool. Um, how do I put this back in there? How about this? Pretty cool camera. I like that aluminum. Let's put this on first and then we'll slide it in. So how does this go on? There we go. It goes like this. It sets in there. 
stuff off. See, I don't know if we've got four, if it calls for four sets of props or um, four um, props themselves. So we got the four um, K gimbal. We'll mark that off. I know we got at least two props. We'll put a two here, circle that. Um, but it says type four. So we can get rid of that box. Let's see what's in this box. All right, another camera. This is a fishing camera. So this one goes up and down. I imagine it just stays down because I don't see no wires connected to that thing unless there's some sort of magnet that runs it. But I imagine that just fishes down like this and it's got a bait switch here and there's a control remote on the remote it releases the the bait so this is the fishing setup so this is the fishing camera payload with the payload and uh It did not come with extra rubber bushings and the clips and everything like the other one did. I don't know if it's supposed to, but I would assume so. It's got the key to lock it onto the drone, but it does not have that extra, um, the extra pieces like the other drone has. So I do not know if it's supposed to, but I would imagine so. Why would that camera come with extra pieces and not this one? All right, so we got the 4K uh, camera. That thing, it looks nice. And then we've got the fishing camera and setup. All right, let's see what's in this box. sunshade cover that goes on to protect your uh to keep the sun off your screen so you can see it i'm imagining uh, we'll try that out after but that's a sunshade for the remote that's right here let's cross that up now i did call these uh this company because I did not, it went to spam. I did not get the email that it shipped. So I called them out. Or I called, I went to call them. But if you call the, call this company, I'm in Louisiana, obviously, with the name Fish in Louisiana. And um, their time zone is like 10 hours in front of us or behind us, 10 to 12 hours. So if you want to get a hold of them, um, I've never tried calling them, but if I leave an email for them at 9 o'clock at night, they get back to me within minutes. I've emailed them twice, and both times they emailed me back so fast that I was very impressed. They were very friendly. They always always answered my email. I, I emailed them three times, and all three times they e emailed me. Do not pull. Okay, this is, I'm imagining this is the extra remote battery. It's a nice little sturdy battery. So let's put, cross that off. I'm trying to make sure that we get what was supposed to be in the order, you know what I mean? Let's put that back in plastic. So, so far, I have been nothing but happy with the customer service, especially, and the, the, the speediness of it. 
I think it was only five days. Now, I know this country's up overseas because of the way their time zone is so different than ours. But it was shipped out of Texas and it got here super fast. Once they uh, said the order was in, once the order went in, it was, it was days. I'm telling you, four to five days it was delivered. I actually got this first bag of all these boxes first and then got um, the, uh, the big box later. So this must be the drone battery. Man, that's a heavy battery. Uh, 5200 MAH. Yeah, that's a monster battery. It's got a couple different plugs on it. I don't know what all those plugs are for. It's got two separate plugs on it. I don't know what that's for. One for charging. Two separate plugs. I'm going to get rid of these two boxes. So I'm assuming this is a battery too. Oh, let's mark that down. We're supposed to have three drone batteries. Well, let's look at this one first and we'll mark down two. Because I've only got two boxes that are the same size here. Yeah. By the weight of it and the size of the exact same. Those are both uh, drone batteries. So we got two drone batteries. We're looking for one more drone battery. All right, what we got here? Oh, it says S3 goggle glass. It's got a nice little carrying case. fly this drone in first person view. Oh, I can't see nothing on my glasses. But uh, it's supposed to be really, it's got the instructions in here. Um, some sort of piece of padding. I don't know where that padding goes. Maybe on the nose piece or something. I don't know. It's got a couple antennas. The screw on here. It's got a band button here, channel, power. I don't know what that M is. It's either an M or a W. I imagine it's an M. I don't know. That looks like power. I don't know. That one looks like a circle with a line coming off it. The power button's got the circle with a line going into it. It's got some things on the bottom, AV in and out, ear out, DC in. Uh, USB and TF. It looks like an SD card slot. And I don't know what these switches do here. Oh, it moves your your lenses from left to right for your so you can center your eyes in, in it. That's really cool. All right, so we got some FPV goggles, and uh, from what they say. These goggles can be used with any other drone. Oh, and it has a battery in here for the goggles. There's a battery there, and here's the battery. So, oh, there's a battery in it, and there's a battery. So it's got two batteries for the goggles themselves. That's nice to know. I didn't think they would send it with the battery in it. So that's something that we just learned. So we got um, the goggles. So that is actually all the stuff. And that is all the extras. The only thing that I do not see uh, from the extras that were supposed to be was just that little, it's just a little piece. And it, um, it's a tension or a trolling thing for the, um, you hook your bait, your fishing line to it and you can troll with the drone and when a fish grabs it, the tension will let it release on its own. So um, like with this camera one, the one with the camera, you have to hit the button to release the, the line. So with that one, if a fish bites, it releases. So let's open this big box and see what we got. Yeah, sucker's heavy. Oh, this is the drone. But man, there's a lot of pieces.
pieces, so that would either come up right there. Wow, check this out. It's a suitcase. That's impressive right off the bat. And that's very impressive. That's a sturdy suitcase this thing comes in. Let's take a look at what's inside. Wow, it comes bigger than I thought. This is a massive look at the size of this controller. It's got its own computer screen. Check that out. Screen tilts. I don't know how this goes on there, but I imagine. Oh, I see. Looks like this just clips onto it. Clips over the screen, and then this goes on it. Over the top of it, like that. So when you're flying this, you can keep the sun off it. That's nice. Calibrate the compass and the accelerometer of the drone. Fully charge the drone and remote control battery before you fly. Calibrate, fully charge, remove the clear protective stickers on the top of the drone. Read the user's manual, review your tutorial videos on, at YouTube's Well Pro. All switches must be in the up position when powering on the remote. So all these switches go up. It's got airdrop off on video, preview, photo. This has got GPS, cruise, and ATTI. This is normal and return to home. There's a couple buttons here. Down here, it shows the battery light, the status. It's normal and smooth. It's got some knobs. Normal and smooth. I guess those are for the controllers. It's got a hook right here. I imagine that hook is for um, a lanyard that can go around your neck. But let me tell you, that is a massive controller. All right, since the goggles had it, yeah, look, there's a, a battery here, plus we have a spare battery. So we've got two batteries. So let's mark this down. Uh, remote, we got a remote. And a uh, controller battery. So we got two controller batteries. We just got a drone in here. I can see that right off the bat. All right, let's put this uh, back in here. It's very, uh, very well built, man. This thing is very well built. We'll probably get everything on charge tonight, and then we'll uh, go try this thing out, huh? See what we can get into. All right. We got a controller. We got here. Oh, two more sets of props right here. So that was four. Four sets of props, not four props. So we've got four sets of props. We've got a drone. We've got some landing gear. big drone. Good grief. That thing's a monster. 
Okay, let's take a look inside this. This is your GPS receiver. It says that this is the front. You can see it says front here and here. This has got a waterproof seal in it. This drone is waterproof. Can be totally submerged. It'll write itself. Let's see, so we gotta remove this sticker before we fly, but we'll do all that when we follow the directions on how to calibrate this thing. It does have a battery in here. I don't know what this other plug is for. There's your power setup. Man, how do you even get the battery in that thing? It's tucked way up under there. I don't know how you get that thing in there. That's gonna be tricky. <coughs> Got a whole microprocessor and everything in here. Here's your uh, GPS. That's pretty cool. This thing is uh, impressive. We're gonna leave those feet on, and we're gonna. Okay, so we're gonna leave this. Uh, we're gonna leave these feet on for now while we. Um, we're gonna finish putting this thing together see what it looks like let's see what else is in the box we got the props so we have the four props we do have there's a battery there three batteries there so we have all three drone batteries this is the balance charger stop start status imagine this is the power cord for it indeed it is so we got the balance charger. It says balance charger cables. So this goes like this. There's a pack here. It says accessory package. Oh, we do have the landing gear. We put that on. We have the carry case. Battery charging cables, balance charger cables, okay, let's see what's in here. Oh, this must be that lanyard that hooks to the remote. That's a battery charging cable. This is an antenna. I don't know what this antenna goes to. There's two antennas. Oh, they must go to the remote. Yeah, those two antennas go on the remote. This is... I don't know. I don't know what that is. Um, here's the splash drone manual. Apparently, that this cable plugs into here. This cable plugs into here. These two cables plug into here. And then both of these plug into the batteries. You gotta be careful, those pins do not look. This is a USB cable. Um, so this must, I don't know what this does. There's a USB small port there. <coughs> Power plug. This thing does all kinds of stuff. I don't know what this is, it looks like a little loop. And then these are the pieces, that piece, black piece right there, I think it's the antenna for the GPS and a padded piece, a spare one. There is one on the drill. So we do have a ton of cables to go with it. We've got these cables for the smaller batteries, these cables for the bigger batteries. We've got this cable. It takes all those cables. Two cables to charge a battery. I don't know why. One's a computer operator or something. I don't know. 
but this is the, the accessory bag. And so I'm gonna say those are the balance charger cables and those, the accessory pack and the battery charging cables. So it looks like I do not see the ground station. It's a black box. I don't know what these plugs go to. There's a couple extra plugs. Oh, they go on the bottom of the drum. And a couple extra of those and a couple stickers. You got how to charge it. This is battery charging instructions. You got the user's manual. There's a bunch of stuff you have to do to this thing before you start it up. I like how that st sticks right there. This goes in here nicely. So uh, let's get this out of our way. Let's, set, let's see what this drone looks like. With um, let's put one of the cameras on. Let's put a good camera on it. Let's see how simple this is to hook up. This is the uh, 4K. This is for filming. It's not the fishing one. Imagine it goes on just like this. Wow, that couldn't have been any easier. And there's a waterproof cap here. You take this cap off. And it's got a waterproof plug that plugs straight into here. And it's got up, down, okay, the power button and mode button there. You gotta make sure you do not bend these things. nervous to push on this thing. There we go. Just needed to be a little push in there. That's got a rubber gasket in it. it. Makes it waterproof. That's pretty cool. Oh, check that out. It's got a kind of a self-leveling feature. It's got a weight on here. Oh, that's a rubber. That's a piece of a uh, foam for transportation what's under here okay there's a usb port and a sim card port in there there we go now this thing should should do its work on its own works but we'll check it out after but that's the front of the drone that camera was set just like that that's pretty cool let's put some props on this thing this thing is really heavy it, is, it seems well built okay now these say CW and CCW so clockwise and counterclockwise this says CCW so that's this prop, and there's a little dot above it. So I imagine this goes where the lock is on the unlock position. You don't want to put much weight on this thing. And then you turn it, there you go, it's locked. Oh, that's easy. Man, these go on so easy. Same thing, CW, CW, put it where the unlock is, it slips right in. Locked. Cool. Let's put the other ones on. I do not want to lose this cap. I'm going to put this cap in here. So you don't lose it. I'm going to leave that camera out there for now. What I do wish um, is that the, the 
two cameras. I wish those came with uh, their own carrying case because what am I going to do to protect these cameras when they're not on the drone? But my first first thoughts on this thing is, like I said, customer service was phenomenal. The shipping, fast, real fast shipping. But that's what we, that's what we got. This thing is a monster. Those props are at least 10 inches. Yeah, they're all at 10 inches. Real super well built. This thing is nice. It's got, I can tell you right now, those are gonna be the red and green lights there. Um, these are some rubber plugs. That's what these extra plugs are, I know that, in here. Uh, it's got the power button here, an antenna here. I already uh, got my uh, drone license. Um, I have a, a private pilot's license, so the part 107 and all that, I had already taken all that, so I do not need to retake all that stuff again. So they're just sending me that stuff. But all in all, super cool, super cool drone.